Tutorial time! Eternity Forever, All Alone Tutorial, Part 3. Okay, so this is definitely the most difficult part of probably the whole EP. It's just hard. Uh, or I find it much harder than a lot of the rest of the stuff anyway. Um, so we'll see how you get on. So this begins with that little run there, which is seven, pull off to six on your top string, and then seven on your second, eight, six, slide to four, and six on your fourth. So. And then from there we play that, which is an open E string. Let that ring out uh, throughout the whole thing. And on top of that, we have sixth fret on your third string. It's like a, it's a half bend, I suppose, but it's like a flick, quick bend. And then we go four, six, slide up to eight. And then we do seven on your second string. And then back down, uh, eight, six, and four, so. So all together. And then from there. So this little lick starts with a G sharp, which is the fourth fret on your bottom string. And then we play four, pull off to three, and a four uh, on your fourth string. So it's four and three on your third string, sorry. And then a four on your fourth string. So let this note ring out underneath like we do. And once you've hit those two fours, we slide both of those up to six. So. And then from there, we jump up second string, uh, seven, pull off down to four, and then an open E string to finish. So. So with this one, they have the option of picking it all with your pick or hybrid picking. Um, either one works just as well. So all together from the start of that section, we have. Okay, and on the top of this bit, um, it's quite difficult to hear because this has got quite a bit of delay and stuff on, uh, which is another thing he likes to use to good effect. So, uh, the notes I can definitely hear. Uh, and on top of that, it sounds like there's a chord at the start of it, but I'm not sure what it is. Uh, but I can hear that note throughout. So I play that. So that is, I want to hold um, a C sharp which is the ninth fret on your top string. And underneath that, we want those notes, which I find tapping them uh, is the, well, I suppose the only way of reaching them, really. So uh, a nine and a 12, and then hammer on with your little finger to 14, tap on 16, 14, 12, and then slide that back to 11, so. It's all together. Okay, and your next part. So this starts off with a very similar lick. With one different note in it. So we do uh, that pull off the same, and then we come down seven, eight, and go down to that six. But instead of going down, we go. Um, so you could slide like that if you want. Uh, but I go six, nine, and back to six again, so. And then we have this little chord here, uh, which is, uh, I suppose like an A7 type chord, um, which is kind of like a D7 shape. Moved up there, so it's nine, eight, and nine. So we strum that, and then on top of that, 
we have that melody, which goes 9, 7, 9, slide up to 11, and back down. And we finish on 9 on your second string. So with that chord. So all together. And then we have this part. So this is a G sharp minor chord. So that is 10th fret on your A string, that's your G sharp. Then we have the octave, which is 13th fret on your third string. And then the minor third, which is your B, which is 12th fret on your second string. And we pick those three notes. And then the melody on top of that goes like this. So we keep those notes there. And I use my little finger to move up and down that. So it's 12, 16, 14, 16. And then we finish on an E major 7 chord, uh, which we've done previously, which is 7, 9, 8, 9. So, so that whole second section. All together from the start, nice and slowly. That is it. That is the end of my tutorial series for All Alone. If you want my tab for how I work this song out and how I play it, uh, go look at my original cover video. Uh, and the link is in the description of that one. And there we go. Enjoy. Happy playing. Uh, I hope that, I think this works out better doing it in parts because then you've not got one big long like 30 minute video to watch and to skip through just to get to the bit that you want to learn how to play. Um, so uh, yes, hope it goes down well. And I'll see you next time for more Tutorial time. That hurt. Tutorial time. <laughs> ¶¶